with another video and yeah so today is my first day integrating in pediatrics and child health yeah so today i'm based at the whittington hospital and everything just feels really surreal um but yeah i'm just gonna give you guys a little day in the life um show you what it's like and i've lived out my whole time at uni in first year i was in halls accommodation in second year i live in a flat with my friends and this year i moved back home so i'm commuting to uni um, which is around an hour, hour 10, hour 15 journey. So yeah, I'm up a lot earlier. <laughs> I'm tired, but it's fine. Um, but yeah, no, I'm definitely excited. So first action of getting ready, I attempted to put earrings in all of my piercing holes, which I normally do first, but I'll be real most days I don't even do it because it's a drag, but I thought, first day of third year you know i'm trying to look cute and then after that i brushed out my non-existent eyebrows and filled them in and then did my hair just tied it up you know it was goddess braids which were really cute and then tried to put some gel on my edges because you know they were looking a bit rough and following that i used my one pound hair shop lip gloss just to finish off the look very simple and put my glasses on which my hair got attached to and i promise you that hair got attached to everything it was so jarring even though it looked so good then i spent like a good five minutes just looking at myself in the mirror making sure everything was perfect and i was ready to go to my first day at the hospital i'm ready and yeah i'm about to make my way to the whittington i can't lie i didn't estimate the time well because i'm running a bit late i forgot commuting you need to put an extra sign but yeah I'm not even gonna lie, commuting is not for the week. Like, I, I literally, I gave myself so much time this morning and somehow I'm still rushing. I have lost my AirPods. I actually left my house. I was about to like put them in my ears and I was like, where are they? But I'm already like 10 minutes away, so long. Yeah, I've got breakfast in my bag though. I've got a banana, I've got some bread rolls got some juice you know what i mean i wasn't gonna go on an empty stomach but i really did not plan this well so to start my journey i took a bus and then a train which felt really strange because i'm used to being maximum a 20 minute walk from campus but after that i walked to the whittington hospital up the very tiring hill so i was out of breath and that took me to my first session we then had a break in the hospital canteen I did a quick fit check in the mirror before making my way to my next session where we learnt how to take a detailed patient history. All right, hey guys. Northwest, like, so I'm here with Anne Mary right now. <laughs> hey, Fritz. Oh hey, Lima. Lima. <laughs> how did you guys find the morning of peace? It was very fun. Good? Yeah. Excited? Feeling like medical students. No, hundreds, hundreds. We know now, we now know how to take a history. Take a history um, from a mother and a baby and so in our first session we had to act out different situations that you would encounter in pediatrics from toddlers to teenagers and we had to practice being the doctor in those situations and taking a history she was an amazing toddler amazing <laughs> <laughs> difficult one i literally traumatized like the whole class mm -hmm. no but it was scarily good i got traumatized i got by the moody teenager yeah, actually, I think I, i'm the one who's traumatized by children like, but, <laughs> i feel like so, my is it a day and it's like you want the child left <laughs> what do you want the child less no 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 like yeah. want children yeah. less uh, uh, but i feel like when it's your own child that you'll have like some kind of patience and I went to the kebab shop for lunch and then we ate in the common room as a group before session two, which was team bonding in the park where we learned how to put nappies on and dress our babies. Oh, guys! Hey guys, just, just finished peas. How did you find the first day of peas? It was actually really chill. You learned how to put a nappy on. Yeah. Nappy on a baby? <laughs> what yeah. about you? Yeah, it was good. It was good. I enjoyed it. You guys yeah. excited for the year? <laughs> yes, sir. <laughs> what are you most excited for? Um, I just feel like the small group settings with everyone. Mm -hmm. It would be nice. 
a nice conversation. Mm -hmm. I'm most yeah. excited about getting a pediatrician like, mental. Mm -hmm. like, they're going to be so helpful in like, giving us like, advice and stuff that like, we're not going to get an opportunity like that again. So, mm -hmm. I think it's super that yeah. we get to see this child go from like, birth to oh, yeah. nine months. That's what it's cool. <laughs> that concluded my first day in peds so we all went our separate ways and i made my way to costa to do some admin do a little bit of work and charge my phone so update i have finished my first day of like lectures and team building in peds and right now i'm just in costa i just need to charge my phone and i'm about to go and get my nose fist <laughs> whim so we'll see how that goes so I went to my trusted piercer who has done most of my piercings but guys I was so scared because I've never got a piercing anywhere but my ears guys I got it done do you know what <laughs> So I did not like the piercing when I first got it done. I thought it was in the wrong position on my nose, but I couldn't exactly take it out. So I just kept it stepping. But anyways, thanks for watching guys and tune in to see more videos of what I get up to on my med school journey.